Earlier I showed you guys and I went to the Apple store to get my new laptop. So I'm back on my editing, you know, shenanigans. So I bought the one that I wanted, the MacBook Pro. So after my MacBook stopped working, I was using a MacBook Air M1. But it couldn't manage the Final Cut program, so I just decided to invest in a MacBook Pro. So I'm going to do a quick unboxing to show you guys. And I'm so excited. I'm so excited I'm proud of myself because I don't know how bad it was with me being without a laptop. So this is what the box looks like. It shows a reflection of what's in the box, of course. I'm going to pull it. Alright, yeah, I think this one, I think, yeah, this is the one, this is the one, because the silver one is silver, this is more of a darker color, so this is the one I wanted, I never wanted the silver one, like the one I had before, so I'm going to show you guys what else coming in the box before I turn it on, so, a charger, you know, USB charger thingy, this is like a manual and I know that normally in Apple things they give like stickers I also wanted to buy my phone today but they didn't have any so I'm gonna try and get that somewhere else so this is the adapter yeah this is what it looks like when you open it and they have like this thing on the screen so you know the regular hello and you change the language English I normally create new iCloud. I do have a choice but to create new iCloud either way because the MacBook I had it just stopped working. It's a case where I don't even get nothing back from the laptop there either way because I never back up anything on it or whatever the case is. I'm going to actually create a new Apple ID for this. So initially when I did the unboxing, I couldn't move from the step where it was asking me to log into my iCloud. Because it was sending a code to my Jamaican number that I wasn't getting because I'm not in Jamaica. It took me a while to figure that out. And after that, I didn't end up finishing the video. So now I'm continuing. So this is what the MacBook looks like after I'm in. I cloud setup. Everything is fine. You know, down here you have the regular applications. If you have a MacBook or ever had one or familiar with the interface, you will kind of know what it looks like. It's pretty cool. I'm familiar with this because I had a MacBook before. Nothing is new. And this is a MacBook Pro M2 2022. I'm kind of happy I waited until I get here to buy the, my MacBook because the one I was getting in Jamaica was a MacBook Pro M1. Basically for the same money. So I'm happy that I waited until I get here to get my laptop so I was able to get the latest one i love it so much love everything about it of course you guys know this is my favorite part the touch bar it is super fast and i honestly love that because it is managing the program so well which really and truly macbook pros were made to basically manage more ft softwares or whatever the case is i'm not a tech girl i don't know the correct terms so don't judge me so now that we're through with the unboxing of my MacBook, I'm going to unbox my AirPod. This is my third pair of AirPods and I don't want to get any more anytime soon. So I had the first, first one. Then I had the AirPods Pro. I actually still have one of them. One fell under my handbrake. I was thinking twice for like almost six, seven months so that I should get a new one. And I decided to get one. My friend is going to get me one for my Christmas, but 
I just went ahead and get it because I, you know, yeah. So these ones are a little bit different. I never had these. I had the um, Pro, AirPod Pro, and the first generation. I think this is the third generation. So it just came in the mail, and I decided that I'm going to do a quick look at unboxing so you guys can see what's in the box, whatever the case is. So it is not open as yet or anything. As you can see, it is still sealed right there. So yeah. Um. You know, good old Apple. And this is my new AirPods. Welcome me back to the AirPod gang. Because I've been in on the AirPod for a while. This though is, it, I think it's giving a little bit smaller than the AirPod Pro case. Because, mm, I don't know. I think my AirPod Pro case was a little bit smaller than this one. I'm trying to remember. But this is what it's looking like. Tiny and sleek. And these are my new earpods. <laughs> They're little and cute. Hopefully they can fit in my ears. Well, they should be. Should be. And they have the left right on them. It's pretty and cute. So, nothing y'all shouldn't be familiar with. And you know they have the left and right. So, I know in the box they normally have like a charger in there. So, yeah, they have a charger. I normally just keep these chargers for like future use. For example, if I want to change my phone charger, I will have this extra one. Instead of using one charger for my earpod, one charger for my phone. Also, I'm going to change my phone. So, I'm going to get a new card. So, this will be in the box. I'll just let this stay in the box. Because I don't necessarily need it right now. This is how this do. Yeah, I don't need it right now. So, I'm just going to put it back in the box. But I wanted to show you guys what came in it. Also, if you're pretty much familiar with Apple products. You know that they always have like, you know, a manual so you can go through to know how to connect it, stuff like that. And they normally send stickers, but I realize that they no longer pack stickers in their stuff. And I, I'm not sure if I normally get stickers in my AirPods packages. Because I buy all my AirPods straight from Apple and unbox. I like normally do the unboxing myself, but I don't remember what and what normally comes in it. So... This is what it's like. So I need to get an AirPod case. I'm just going to get one AirPod case. And you know, funny thing is I had AirPod case. And I gave them away because I was like, I'm not buying no more AirPods. I'm tired. I'm ever lost. I'm ever lost. Did this, that, something. The first one didn't last, actually. The first one, I wanted to just upgrade as to why I got the Pro. And once something was wrong with one of the AirPods, like, it was giving a little muffled sound so yeah but then when my airpod pro fell under my handbrake i was like mm, i'm done with airpods for real but here am i back again so i'm gonna buy a case for this because i try my best to like buy things to protect my gadgets so you know them last song of them not scratchy scratchy because you see once they start drop it's gonna just scratch up and just look terrible i also need to buy an airpod cleaner just to make sure you know they stay clean because some people in you know, them case and as people say some people it can it gets can get very dirty at times to be honest naturally you know what dust everything gets in get in the case and it took a look away i don't want that so yeah that's it for this video and this is basically a little gadget unboxing yeah you can call it that my phone was supposed to be a part of this but apple do have any so when i get my phone if i feel like doing an unboxing i will or if not i will just probably do a watch on my iphone whatever so yeah hope you guys really enjoyed this video 
don't forget to like subscribe comment and yeah hopefully in the near future i can do cool giveaways where i can give you guys cute little gadgets and stuff but we're manifesting it guys we are manifesting it but i got y'all so yeah until next time bye babies Thank you.